just after my dinner there, we quick scoot into Tim Hortons, free PR and all that. Um, it's a big one. It's Friday night. We're in Belfast. It's Linfield against Glen Torn. And these two teams hate each other. The fans hate each other. The clubs hate each other. And I'm here to capture it. And I'm in the blues end of the night. Let's try and go to the home end in games because usually away tickets, you know, sell out in this sort of game. So I can't really take a ticket off a fan, if you know what I mean. Anyway, my ticket was donated to me as well by Big James A. Hall. So thank you, big lad. Um, what have we got to say? This week, there's been a bit of to and fro on Twitter and Linfield's media team have got involved in it and you'll see on the side of the screen the stuff that they've been putting up and it's winding people up they've wind, they've wound people up in the League of Ireland they've wound up Glen's fans they're winding up their own fans all to make this the biggest attended domestic league match in the whole of this island in this year and we'll find out tonight whether they made it or not anyway we'll go and talk to people and See what's happening in and around the ground, see what people think. Let's go. Lads, it's the biggest league game of the season so far tonight. Linfield against them other boys. What's the score reduction tonight? 2 1. And if you had to describe Glentorn in three words or less, how would you describe them? No, you can! <laughs> Do the PC version. <laughs> or the... I don't know, Ah, come on, lads. Scumbags! <laughs> That's the one. <laughs> lads, this is the biggest game so far of the season. Linfield against Glen Torn. What is the score predictions tonight? 3-0. 3-0 to the Blues, obviously. 3-0 the Blues. 3-0. You know, and if you had to describe Glentorn in three words or less and try and remember this is going to be on YouTube, how would you describe them? Shite. <laughs> Ugly and just scum. Shite. Yes. Get them. Perfect. <laughs> that's that's right. good, lads. Right. PG, mate. You stab it, you stab it. Don't have PG, so go on YouTube. It doesn't matter, man. There's cursing all over. I curse. Really cursing? Oh, I curse. PG, don't curse. Here. Remember, it's your face that's going to be on it. So, first of all, score prediction for the night 2 1 Linfield. And. 3 1 Linfield. And. 3 0 Linfield. And if you had to describe Glentorn as a football club in three words or less, Scum, rap, bastards. <laughs> Don't like any of them. Embryo. I'm oh, Troy Walker. <laughs> I only eat one. Here. One thing can I say is for the video. Go on ahead. Troy Walker, Sam Robinson, you are muck. <laughs> <laughs> Don't go to Westburn. <laughs> Unless you're me. <laughs> Thank you. Man. Cheers, lads. Yes, buddy, what's your name? Colin Courtney. And here, big game of night. You nervous? Nope, nope. Not nervous? Nope. Oh, 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 it's a derby game and you're not nervous? Nope. Well here, what's the score reduction then? Uh, 3-1 in field. And here, one more thing. If you had to describe the Torn as a football club in three words or less, what would they be? Uh, Pure honor crop. <laughs> That's four, but it'll do. Uh, <laughs> Cheers. The DJ is playing Jerry Cinnamon. Brian now, class. Brian.
Yes, the game of the season so far. Left mid, mid toward El Clasico. And back to I'm ready to go here at Wizard Park.
I watched the, the goals back there, Bobby Burns, unfortunate, and then um, the defender, that wasn't a penalty, lads, but Linfield can take it, they're 2-0 up, scoring an early goal in this half, could be any score, let's get a seat. in the derby. White. Seven thousand seven hundred and seventy two. That's seven thousand seven hundred and seventy two. And we thank you all for your support this evening. 
didn't get the regular attendance for a league game in the island. Weren't far off, 7-7. Seven, seven. The Linfield FC Dot Man of the Match, sponsored by Ronnie Morrison, goes to Linfield's number five, Chris Shields. The Blues won the big two tonight. Uh, Grantorn were poor, awful. Manfield were hungry, they wanted it. They took their chances when they came. Uh, the penalty was soft. The other goal was it's quite fluky. But they took their chances. And Glentorn didn't create any chances to take. So if you like our videos and all that there, subscribe, comment and like and do all that there crazy stuff because then I'll keep making them. If you don't like, subscribe, comment, I'll not make them because I can't afford to make them, to be honest with you. So, cool. Ciao.